Start by unplugging the wire, removing the battery, and then using a small sharp blade, carefully remove the screw covers located at the bottom of the screen. Then, using a Phillips head screwdriver, remove the two screws located under the screw covers. Take care not to lose these screws. Next, using gentle pressure from behind the screen bezel, lift the screen starting in the lower left corner away from the back panel and set that aside. Next, remove the two screws holding down the rails that secure the screen located at the top of the screen using a Phillips head screwdriver. You'll notice that these screws are shorter than the screws that secured the bezel. They are not interchangeable. At this point, the screen should be able to be angled away from the back panel of the laptop. At this point, starting at the bottom, remove the four screws located on each side of the screen. To get the bottom screws, gently lift the screen away from the back panel. These are also... Gently lift the monitor away from the back panel and rest it on the keyboard. At this point, locate the cable going into the back of the monitor. It is secured with tape. Gently peel or cut the tape out of the way. And using careful even pressure, disconnect the old cable. Note the direction of the cable. You need to make sure it faces the same way when plugging it in or you can damage your new monitor or your new screen. Take your new screen and lay it at the same orientation as your previous screen. Plug in the connector. and secure the connector with a piece of tape that is non-conductive. Stand the monitor back into the original place. In between the two rails. Starting at the top, replace the four screws on each side.
Once you have at least two screws in each side, you may attach the AC adapter and power on the computer. This is to test the monitor. Plug in the AC adapter and power on the computer. If the computer screen starts, the monitor is properly installed. Power off the computer and disconnect the AC adapter. If the connector is not attached properly in the back, the computer monitor will not start properly and you need to adjust the connection. Finish connecting the screws located on the sides of the monitor. In order to replace the lowest screws on each side, gently pull out your rail and push in on the edge of the screen to align the holes. Do not over tighten the screws. Apply the top two screws that secure the rails for the monitor. Replace the bezel by aligning it with the hinges and pressing firmly but gently in a counterclockwise fashion. Replace the bottom screws and the screw covers. and your installation is complete.